<laughs> well, here we are again. Follow me to Apex, my friends. Reaper Hunter 23 here, welcoming you back to Let's Play Dragon Fable. So, truth be told, ran into some problems the last time I tried to record. That's why I'm level 9, <clears throat> as opposed to whatever level I was at the end of the last video you would have seen. Basically what happened was I recorded for like an hour and a half, and then, first of all, when I finished the recording session, the video was only an hour. That in itself wouldn't have been much of a big deal, because I would have just recorded the stuff that was missing again, and that's... and yeah. I would have just recorded the stuff that was missing again, and filled it in. But that footage was also messed up, because... It was just screenshots, for some reason. Like, for about seven minutes it would be on one still image of the game. It would still make the noise like I was playing it, but it would be like one still image of the game. And then about every seven minutes or so it would change. Obviously, couldn't be making that into a video. So we're just gonna cover what we did before. Quad Force here, there were the four pieces were spread out in Robina's area. She tells you where to find them, or it gives you, gives you really a annoying hints where to find them. It's not that hard though. Anyway, so we're gonna do the boss fight since I can't go retrieve those for a second time. The boss fight is this nice shout out to Ganon in the Zelda series, though. Ganana nana. I managed to pull this off at like level 7, I believe, is the level I was when I fought him the first time. So, hopefully, and he's like a level 10 recommended, or they recommend you fight him at level 10. Let's see, I'm trying to think of what skills I had beforehand. Er. Alright, I'm pretty sure all of the new skills I got in the last recording section would have been throw, poison, and mind numb. Attacking HP instead of MP. I have... I very rarely find a reason to do that. Unless you specifically see their little blue bar over here go down from one of their attacks, there's no reason to try and do that. I find, anyway. Ow. Alright, we're gonna... We're gonna pull out the extra defense points there. That still hurt. <laughs> Hold out for one more attack before we try and heal. Hmm. Might as well. I usually don't try to do the poison that much. When I get the upgrade class for Rogue later, it does like several attacks before the poison effect too, so that's cool. Although, I still tend not to use it that much. It's funny how despite being like a shout out to Ganon's name, he looks more like just a regular old temple boss. You and Robina the Hood have defeated the evil Gananana. Now the Quad Force will be safe forever, or will it? Sword of Irule again. I have two of those, and they don't sell for anything. I don't know why I didn't just destroy it, but it looks like the Master Sword, so that's funny. 
We are going to destroy it though. Because you get it for zero you do you get zero gold out of selling it. Alright, so at the end of the last video that we were together for here, the Sneevel said that he dumped the box out, or the Black Dragon box at the uh, Sneevel dump site. So we gotta go ask Twilly what's up with that. Okay, that's not what I wanted. I guess he won't tell you if you're already done it. Never mind. Ignore what he's saying to me. He tells you to go further to the right. Or go back out of town. And then... We go that away instead of Sherwood. And then he sat on a turtle. Ha 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 ha. Oh. I wonder if that was actually funny. See, we gotta talk to this lady. Quests. Treasure Hunter. Oh, I know. Treasure Hunter? Treasure Hunter. I love these names. Valencia's pretty cool. Of course I know him. Why? He's my father. You went searching for the ultimate tre treasure in the Temple of Gloom and never returned. Until he does, I'm running the family business. Ultimate treasure? I don't know. If I knew, I would be going after it too. But Pops can have that one. I'm after a much bigger prize. Excuse me. Legend has it that there's an all-powerful weapon called the Blade of... Aw, uh, um, oh, shucks, you don't want to hear about that rusty old thing. Well, I, so are you a hero? Well, how interesting. I love hearing stories about heroes. What's your story? Well, were you a young child raised on a farm who left to pursue a life of action and adventure? No. Do you have amnesia and forgotten that you are actually royalty or have some secret hidden power? No. Was your homeworld destroyed and you were sent here on the last escape pod? Wait, did you just rip out No. Was your family taken from you at an early age, causing you to train your entire life to protect others? No. Um, are, you t are any more comic book origins you want to throw at me? Did you, find Did you find your superpowers the day you lifted your weapon above your head and said, by the power of numbskull? <laughs> Did you go back in time in a cool-looking car to change the course of history for the better? No. Do you have some sort of cool looking birthmark, which is a symbol or a, or symbol, which is a part of your destiny? No? Whispers. Did you realize the world around you is really a computer game and you are the one? No. <laughs> you're absolutely. Are you absolutely sure you're a hero? We're gonna have to work on your hero story. This is a very important part of being a hero. Um, sure. You should introduce yourself and tell you... Oh, wait, hold on. You should visit the forums and introduce, and introduce yourself and tell everyone how you, Hunter, came to be. Black Dragon Box. Wait, what? You're after the Black Dragon Box? That's what I was trying to ask about. Oh, wow, I can't believe it's you. So you are the one. Destined to become a Dragon Lord. Hard. What? <laughs> Alright, so that whole exchange was very well done, in my opinion. I love that bit. Just the slowly shrinking heart. She begins to realize you're kind of lame. It's great. Inside the black dragon box was an egg. The Sneevel must have dumped it out. Amazing how they can open any lock. Clue for later. Gulps. I know where the Sneevel dump site is. I will help you find the egg. Hmm, I wonder how much it would be worth. Hey. Just between us, I'm a bit surprised. Why? From the looks of you, I would have guessed you would be going after the white dragon box. Excuse me? There's two of them? Never mind that. Let's go find where the Sneevel tossed our, uh, your dragon egg. 
All right. So we're going to invite her to the group. Valencia is pretty cool as a partner. Oh, she does rubber band now. That's sweet. Before, she was locked at, like, level 7 or 8. The Sneevil dumped a dragon egg out of the black dragon box at the Sneevil dump site. I can show you where that is. Alrighty. Wow, I think she has more than... I don't remember her having dual strike. That's cool. A family of spiders has made this helm their home. This book is called How to Find Books Under Trees. Guess you don't need it. <laughs> Alrighty. Yeah, Valencia's got a double attack, her own throwing knife. The lyrics to a song called The Ballad of Stan or Sanford and His Son. This jerk is why I had to go and find a new weapon. Because he is a golem who is resistant to metal. Which is my default. Like, you can't damage him at all. Which is my default. Which was my two weapons beforehand. The silent slash and the dagger. I hate it when that happens. It's the worst. Anyway. So Valencia won't do anything to him. I don't know if High Kick will do anything to you, whatever. Alrighty. What's this thing? Lots of dagger holes in this chest piece. No wonder someone threw it out. A piece of burlap. Cool. Wow. She is harder than I remember. Cast iron pot has seen one too many bad stew recipes. There's something icky all over the handle. Resourceful treasure hunter. She can throw it. She gets an extra little potion there, which doesn't really matter since early game monsters only attack you. I'm just thankful that Valencia's attacks don't heal this thing. Otherwise, we would be in trouble. Yeah. Ah, all right. One more on the screen. I don't know why I said one more. Like that was the last monster. Oh, I resist the immobility effect. I hate it when that happens. Alrighty, 44, that was a pretty solid hit. Nice. 61 is also really solid. A mystery bag that smells like gorilla fit feet. Better leave it here. There are a lot of these skulls. The Sneevils must have found a crate of them. Oh, sweet, a healing pad. Well, that was a little underwhelming after the, uh... At least Valencia made up for it. <laughs> With an attack of 49, but... Alright. All healed up and ready to go. 
Wow, a stick. A small voice calls your name from inside the space, but you know better than to look in. Okay. Alright, show off the hike. Well, Jesus, I wasn't ready for that. <laughs> I was like, show off the high kick with its actual attacking instead of not being able to damage anything. So I think I've shown every move that she can do. She is hitting unnaturally hard. This axe, this looks like a fine axe, but look, looking closer, you see it has no stats on it. <laughs> Forget that. Oh, that's funny. The dragon egg. Finally, the dragon egg is mine. I've gone through a lot for this. Now all I have to do is pick, is walk five feet ahead of me and pick it up, and it will be mine. Um, all right. So you want to go ahead and do that? Yep. That's all I have to do. I just need to reach out my hand and take my prize. And I will, I will claim my prize because I have earned it. I will claim it in just a few seconds. Um, dude. I should know better than this, but I really want to savor the moment of final triumph. After this moment, after all, this moment only comes around once, and I want to enjoy it. So I'll just stand here for a few seconds and... Crew, crew, crow, crow. You know, he was asking for it, to be honest. Are, are you kidding me? Did that just happen? Great. Dracheth, Sneevels... Now giant birds. What next? Hey bird, I bet Valencia knows where you live, and I'm coming for my dragon egg. Let go my egg crow. <laughs> I love this game. It was actually a vulture dragon, and a very large and very scary one at that. There's no time to spare, Valencia will know what to do next, right? Alright. Vulture Dragon. A huge vulture dragon stole the egg? I bet he was an altar of vulture dragon. And I bet he lives at the top of Mount Mordor. Mordor? Is a deadly mountain of treasure and the bane of door to door salesmen everywhere. A huge vulture dragon lives there. Vulture dragons. Vulture dragons. They are wretched scavengers that steal and eat each other's eggs. Their dragons look very similar to dragon eggs. Mount Mordor. All right. <laughs> Mordor. She wasn't kidding when she said the bane of door to door salesmen. All right. Well, I think this is random no matter. Oh, interesting. This isn't where it sent me the first time. That's all right, though. Alright, so these jerks are immune to being immobile. So we're just gonna kick it off with a throw. Ow. Yeah, alright. The doors also don't even correspond to the other doors that look the same. That's not what I wanted. I wanted to go fight that guy. High kick. Wow. Alright. Proved to be a little trouble. No, wait, that's where I came out of. Oops. That was easy. Aha, there are there they are all six of them. Okay, so there are six eggs. So what? I'll take all six and sort them out later. Creo, creo. 
I don't want to hear it. You stole my egg in the first place. The rest of them are probably stolen too. You tell them. Besides, do you think I'm just going to stand around after that and talk after that last cutscene? No way, bird brain. I'm taking those eggs and I'm getting out of here as fast as I can. Crow, crow. I want my egg. Battle. I imagine the Ultra Vulture Dragon. Yeah, it has the same resistances as the other one. I think it just has more HP. <laughs> Jeez. Valencia's kick is OP, let me tell you. I guess that would explain why it's 25 mana to do that, and then, you know, only 5 to do the, uh, double attack. At last. I'm not sure which of them is my egg, but I'm going to find out. Until then, I'll have to keep them all safe. All six of... I hope that wasn't the dragon egg. Um, all five of them. You got the dragon egg. Unfortunately, you got four other eggs, too. Maybe Valencia will be able to tell them apart. No, these items will not appear in your backpack. You found that vulture vulture dragon's nest was filled with dragon or filled with large eggs. So you took your dragon egg. So you took all six. Oh wait, that all looked like your dragon egg, so you took all six, uh, five of the eggs. Alright, how do we tell these suckers apart? All five of these legs look identical. I am unable to tell them apart. Hmm, you should take these back to your little red moglin friend. Good luck. Well, thank you, Valencia. You are a peach. Let's see. Oh, that wasn't so bad. 